Hey everyone, it's Duke here at Developer Inspires. Welcome back to the course. In this video, we're going to design a very simple UI, our first UI for the text. So here's another view of the app will look like after this course. So this is the app, we we'll have a table view, and then we can pull to refresh like that, right? And we also have a text field like that. And let's say I want to change to maybe Team Cook, okay? And then we'll see that we have tons of text about Tim Cook and maybe some images, some of the, uh, some of the tweets has some images, right? So let's jump right into Xcode and create a project. So for this, I will cre create a single view application and I will name it text. And then I, I will click next, okay? And then I will place it into my document, create. All right, so let's jump right into main.storyboard and then we will design the UI. So here's our main.storyboard. By default, we have a view controller and I am, I hope that you are familiar with view uh, main.storyboard right now. And then, but our app doesn't need a view controller, just a single view controller. We will need a navigation bar, which is the thing that we have from a navigation controller. And we also have a table view controller. And why do we want to use a UI view control, a navigation controller? Because not only because we have this navigation bar, but because later on, maybe you want to extend this app that in um, in your challenge. You want to maybe we click into this um, tag and then it will show you another detail view, right? So that's the best thing to do with UI navigation controller. So I will delete this one and go to the object palette. I will drag out a navigation controller like that. Drag it out like this. And by default, a navigation controller has the root view controller to be a table view controller, which is best, <laughs> which is very good. So now I want to configure this navigation controller a little bit so that we have this navigation bar to be uh, bluish like this. This is the color of Twitter. All right, so I will select over the uh, document outline. If you don't see it, you can go over this icon over here and click that. And then you will see that we have, this is called the document outline. And for this document outline, you can just select the navigation bar, which is this navigation bar. Select that one and then go over the attribute inspector. For the attribute inspector, I will select the bar tint. The bar tint to be this color. And you wonder what is the code for this color? I can select that one. And the code for this is hexadecimal code is 55ACEE. -E. And this is the code of that Twitter provides me with on their website. Okay. And if you wonder how to find this hex um, code color, you can go to the color palette and then the second tab and then go over here, RGB slider. And you will find the hexadecimal hexa code down below. Okay. And now I want to change the tints. I'm sorry. Sorry. The, it should be the title color to be white like that. Okay. So now let's run this. But before we're doing that, we we should do this. And then select this one to be the initial view controller. Okay. Now let's run this. All right, good. So you see that we have a navigation bar, navigation controller, and we have a root view controller, which is a table view right now. It doesn't have any data source or delegates, right? And it also doesn't have the navigate of uh, the status bar to be white, which we will do that in the next video. But one thing I want to remind you is um, before jumping right into the next video, I want you to familiarize yourself with UI table view. And it is also one of the pre uh, prerequisites for this course, which is UI table view, right? And if you, if you are not familiar with UI table view, check out the UI table view course in right down below. I give you the link right down below. And for this one, I also want to note that what we are building is a 
to the client app. It is just the client, meaning that it will fetch data from Twitter and it is just fetching data from Twitter. It doesn't allow you to um, fetch, uh, to post a tweet or it doesn't allow, we are not building a social networking app, okay? And maybe if you are finding this video on YouTube or any other social networking, you may be like wonder if we are building a nev um, social networking app, but we are not building a social networking app. But if you are finding about how to build a social networking app, check out my course in how to build interactive social networking app right down below. That is my next course, which is a, I think is my best course yet. And in that course, we will learn about how to create um, social networking app, but with stunningly intuitive animation and view controller animation. And after this video, I will send, give you, I want to show you a short video introduction to this course. So I hope that you enjoyed this video and I see you in the next one.